The Future Order Release Program, OE4200, is used to allocate stock to future orders. The screen props for a beginning, ending, expected ship date, warehouse, and order number range, and displays on the screen the orders as they're being processed. In our example, we'll just take a quick look at OE2100, the order entry program, and query upon a future order. So order 2151, execute query, and we have a product here, 57-53130, that's at future order status. This is a future order. So we come over to the dates pop-up, we can see the expected ship date is the 20th of April. If we go a little farther into the detail line, we can see the status of the detail line is at the unreleased future order status. So now we'll go back into the future order release and enter in the expected ship date of the 20th of April. TOR warehouse and execute the program. All orders that fit this criteria, as long as they're future orders and they have an expected ship date equal to or less than the date entered in on the screen will be released. Now if we go back into the order entry program, query upon our order, execute, we can see that our quantity ordered was 10, now our quantity shipped is 10, and the order has been released. If there was no stock available, the order would still be released, but the entire quantity would have went into the back order column. This concludes the tutorial on the order entry future release program.